In this video, we'll use conditional formatting to highlight some of the rows in our table in Excel. I've got a list of files that I'll eventually be updating, and on another sheet, I have a list of the files that I've already updated. So I've done three, there are several more to go. And I'm going to use conditional formatting on this sheet referring to cells on another sheet. So to do that, I'm going to have to name these cells. So I'm going to select column A, click in the name box, and I'll call this update A. So it's column A on the update sheet, and I'll press the enter key. On the list of files, I'm going to select the cells where I'd like the highlighting to happen. With those cells selected, on the Home tab of the ribbon, I'll click Conditional Formatting. And I'm going to make a new rule. I'll use a formula. And we're going to use count if. So equals count if. And now we'll use that. We want to look in that named range we created, so update A. And here we can see that the active cell is A2, so we're going to type a dollar sign and then A2. And by typing the dollar sign, column B will also check column A to see if it's counted in the updated files. Close that cell, and now we'll pick the formatting we'd like. And I'm going to just pick a nice green color and click OK. Click OK again. And the cells 1, 4, and 7 files, which are the ones I've updated, are now highlighted. 